you know what you're being accused of? Yes, I do. Then why did you do it? I can't tell you why I did it. All I know is that I did it, alright? Start from the beginning. Are you serious? You really want me to start from the beginning? It's like an 8 to 10 minute flashback. Is that what you really want? We have the time. It all started on the first day of school, right after gym class. I thought high school was supposed to be the greatest time of our lives. Will be. We just need to make friends and find a place to <laughs> and... oh. Next time you want to play Big Bad Jock, leave me out of it. Where are you going? Nurse! Maybe you get some practice and leave a pain in my butt so I can sit. I'm in my life. Oh. Oh. I just, I don't know how to feel sometimes because like, I just have so many feelings and then no one wants to share. Like all guys are such jerks. Like all of them. Especially those ones with those chin straps. It's like, oh my god, shave already. Tool bags. Right? That is not a that is not facial hair, that is a shaving mistake. That's a shit. You said it, girl. Oh. Hi guys. I like them all. And I don't have a chin strap. Can I hang out with you? Oh, oh, oh. <laughs> Ow. 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 Oh boy. Oh gosh. Ow. What do you have in that purse? Bricks! Oh. Ow. Oh no! Oh no! No, girls, please don't! No. Oh. Ow! Excuse me, please! Ow. Where are your hall passes? Okay. Uh, how come you have no clothes on? Bye ladies. I'll see you later. <coughs> it was fun hanging out with you. And where's your hall pass, young man? Can't you see I was just beat up? Not our job, son. Hall pass, now. Yes, hall pass. I don't have one. <gasps> oh! You idiots! You knocked him out! Um, uh, my bad. Do you think we knocked him out? Uh, just get him to the office! Is he so unconscious? Yeah. Try and wake him up! Wake up! Uh. <laughs> Get up! Oh, oh my God. You're awake. Uh. You're awake. Uh. No, no! Ah. What did you say for yourself? I'm, I'm sorry I didn't have a hall pass. I was just, I was trying to make new friends, meet new people. Rules are rules, kid. We don't make them, just enforce them. Well, since you are new here, I think I can let you off with a warning. How does that sound? A How's that sound? A warning? All this and you're just giving me a warning? Get out of my office! Wait, 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 wait! Oh, oh my gosh. Sit down. Sitting. Now, what would you say if I offered you a position as a hall cop? Um... Well? Does that sound good? Sure. Yeah, mm-hmm. No! Wrong! It's fantastic! You wanna be a hall cop? I, I wanna be a hall cop. That sounds fantastic. Alright! To become a hall cop, there are three trials you must complete. Three! In order to complete them, you'll do exactly as we say. Three! And do everything we say. Three! Drew, tell me a trial! <clears throat> trial one! Oh. You must! Get a bully to make you a- I like it.
Kevin, tell me your trial. You gotta be cool to steal something from the principal's lounge. And my trial is, you must steal the principal's car and go for a joyride. A joyride? Any questions? No? Good. Go do them! Freaks! I know. Oh. Excuse me. Excuse me. <laughs> what? Can can you make me a peanut butter jelly sandwich, please? Oh no. I wanted to eat the sandwich, not feed the sandwich. What are you doing? Are you stealing that? What? That pen! I, uh, I, I, I must have picked it up by accident. Get out of here before I call security! Wait a minute! There's no fork! Oh man, I really hope I don't get caught. This is the principal's car. The idiot left it unlocked. And the keys are in the ignition! Uh -huh. Look at this baby, it rides so smoothly. <laughs> yeah, look at this. Oh, oh yeah. <laughs> he will never know I took his car. Cause he is a little beep. <laughs> Joy ride success. Let's go. Oh boy. And that's how it happened. Pretty much. In a nutshell. So what are you trying to tell me? I'm trying to tell you that him, right over there with the glasses and the face, right there, he's the one who told me to do it. What? Me? No! That's not how it happened at all! I'll tell you how it happened! Why was Timmy driving that car? I don't know, he's crazy. He just wants attention. Why would he say that you told him to do it? Like I said, he's crazy. No, that's not it. Timmy went on that joyride because that's what you told him to do. And when it all went bad, you cut him loose. So now I'm going to ask you, did you order the joyride? Is this a joke? Did you order the joyride? You want answers? I think I'm entitled to them. You want answers? I want the truth! You can't handle the truth! Son, we live in a world that has halls, and those halls have to be guarded by men with hall passes. Who's gonna do it? You? You, Lieutenant Weinberg? I have a greater responsibility than you could possibly fathom. You weep for Timmy and you curse the hall cops. You have that luxury. You don't want the truth, because deep down places you don't talk about at parties, you want me in those halls. You need me in those halls. We use words like honor, code, loyalty. We use these words as a backbone of a life spent defending something. You use them as a punchline. I have neither the time nor the inclination to explain myself to a man who walks the class under the blanket of the very freedom that I provide and then questions the very manner in which I provide it. 
I'd rather you just said thank you and went on your way. Otherwise, I suggest you pick up a pass and stand in post. Either way, I don't give a damn what you think you're entitled to. Did you order the joyride? I did the job I was sent to do. Did you order the joyride? You're goddamn right I did! So can I be a hall cop now? No!